The screen recorder feature here in iOS is super useful, but until now, you've only been able to record mono audio from your iPhone. However, in iOS 13, we now have stereo audio recording capability. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how it works. Let's go. Hi, my name is Pete and this is Studio Live Today where I help you create, record and release your best music. Now, if you, like me, like using GarageBand and other iOS apps and you wanna capture your screen as well as your audio, until now you've been able to do it but you've only been able to get mono audio. So if you have different instruments panned left and right, they all sit in the middle, which is okay, but if you want stereo sound, you have to export it, you have to add it into iMovie, you have to do a bunch of stuff, whereas now we have have stereo screen recording in iOS 13. So let's show you how it works. So to demonstrate this, what I've got is a project here with an acoustic guitar panned hard to the left and an electric guitar panned hard to the right. So what I'm going to do is screen record this project and then you'll be able to hear that the acoustic is gonna be on the left and the electric will be on the right. So to get to our screen recorder, we slide in from the top right corner. On some devices, it'll be from the bottom. If you want to check out a full video, a beginner's guide to screen recording, that'll be linked up there and at the end of this video as well. We're going to tap and hold on the record button. We're going to leave the microphone off for this test and we're going to tap start recording. We're going to get a three, two, one countdown. And there you go, we've started our recording to our camera roll. So we'll tap away from that, we'll tap away again, and now we're ready to go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit play and switch over to the screen recording video and audio so that you can hear the stereo effect. Let's do that now. So if you were listening on stereo speakers or headphones, you would have heard that the acoustic guitar is over to the left and the electric is to the, to the right. Now what I'm gonna do now is just mute out the electric and we'll play this back and then uh, you'll only be able to hear the acoustic guitar on the left and then we'll switch it over just so that you can really hear the stereo definition that we get in this screen recording. Let's go. So there you go, how cool is that? We can now get stereo screen recording here from GarageBand or any other app on your iPhone using screen recording in iOS 13. There's one more thing that I wanna show you that's gonna be very cool for people like me and others who want to share how to do things in GarageBand. So once again, we'll go to our screen recorder, we'll tap and hold, and once again, if you don't know how to set this up in your control center, check out that beginner's guide video that'll be linked at the end of this one. Now, if we tap on the microphone here and we hit start recording, once again, we get our three, two, one countdown, and then we're good to go. And yes, you're probably ahead of me here, but what we can do now is I'll switch over to the screen recorder and here you can hear my voice. It's just using the built-in microphone here on the iPhone, so it's not sounding super good, but if I had a microphone plugged in here, I could record my own voiceover audio, and I can play this audio as well. So if I wanted to say, here is my track, and then hit play. and that's how you do a stereo audio, then I can actually do that. So for tutorials and for anyone demonstrating anything music related here on the iPhone in iOS 13, this is gonna be super handy. Now this is available in iOS 13 right now. There's some other iOS 13 videos linked down in the description. We've also got that beginner's guide to screen recording there, and this will be out on iPad OS very soon as well. So you'll be able to do the same thing on your iPad. Thanks again for watching. Subscribe to the channel by clicking or tapping on the Studio Live Today icon, and I'll see you on the next video.